We're also waiting to see if Kansas City Chief Star Rasheed Rice turns himself in to Dallas police. Arrest warrants charge Rice and another driver with multiple counts in connection with a hit and run. Our Tiffany Liu is following the case and she's joining us now live with the latest. Tiffany. Well, Dia, we are reaching almost 24 hours since these charges came down. That's the amount of time that he is given to turn himself in. So we could expect Rasheed Rice to turn himself in at some point uh, today. Now, he is facing eight charges for the crash on Central Expressway. Rice admitted he was driving a Lamborghini that collided into a speeding Corvette. It involves six other cars, and so his charges include six counts of collision involving bodily injury, one count of collision involving serious bodily injury, and one count for aggravated assault. SMU football player Theodore Knox admitted to driving the Corvette and faces the same charges as Rice, but the passengers in the cars that left the scene with them will not be charged. These are felony charges that carry possible prison time. We spoke with a defense attorney not connected to this case, and he seems to think that prison time is unlikely. Because of his youth and lack of a criminal record, I would be very surprised that anybody would want him to go to prison. Uh, now, I can't speak for the, the people that are going to make those decisions, but I can tell you this. In my opinion, if he is well represented, he will not go to prison. And he's got a good lawyer. Now, Rice can turn himself in at any police precinct. Of course, we are keeping an eye on that for you throughout the afternoon. Let's head back to you in the studio, Dia.